I know I missed something under this in the start, but whatever. It's alright. But then it can be a riddle too. What the hell's going? What the hell's going on? Okay. A bit of a satan is still going on, and uh, what the Christ is going on? Okay, so we tap the picture of the mic, then. Do it, you faggot! Do it! quite a bit of while as well too. And hey, I mean, I absolutely love it as well too. Love it so much, yeah. Alright, there you go. You? Let's, go, let's just go for a Gil. Gil the Hedgehog. <laughs> Alright, the Hedge. Alright. That's gonna work out so goddamn well. <laughs> Oh uh, yeah. Start a you for a new game. Your father has given you a killing order. It is in your notebook. Well, I mean, the biological flesh, but the spiritual father. Oh, I get it. That's quite an interesting thing to keep in mind, if I say. Now, if, and of course, you wonder as well too. I'm feeling a little dizzy as well too. This beer that I'm drinking does not have the alcohol volume volume of 10.1%. So yeah, at least it go down well because I'm needing it. But regardless of that, let's just have, a, have some fun, shall we? Hmm. At least it should be have some benefits of cleaning the body. Now, since alcohol is used for cleaning, but at the same time, that... And some long waiting is green. Was it? I don't know. June 6, 1972. Cold as hell. So it's 66, so... If I calculate it correctly, then Lucius should be about, uh... <laughs> It's time to blow out the candles. Remember to make a wish, honey. That's my boy. Ooh, okay. Very good. What the fire? Happy birthday, son. Why, thank you. Did you see that, Dad? Man, they grow up fast. I bet you can remember my sixth birthday like it was yesterday. Mary, could you please clean up? Lucius can help you with the dishes. He can stay up later this evening to play with his new toys, but in bed no later than ten. Yes, ma'am. <sighs> this ought to be some fun. At least the subtitles are on. Later that evening. She looks like she smoked like 20 packs of cigarettes a day. Of course, I mean, it's exaggerated, but you get the clear idea. 
Yes, we could have some fun. I sense some people must die. <laughs> uh. So what's with the creepy angle or whatnot? Right. Oh, hello there. Oh, yeah, I need to get uh, back. HUD interaction. Introduction. Currently selected skill. Oh. Detection indicator. Current skill level. Current power level. Yes, yes, we could have some fun, you remember? Okay, we're done. <laughs> oh dear, looks like someone stuck inside did a bit of a cleaning. Would be quite a bit of a shame if I... Lower the temperature. <laughs> Don't worry, at least there's plenty of liquor inside. Is it? Hmm, oh no. The lock must have been frozen. What do you do now? <laughs> Enjoy a nice cold sleep. Now it's time for bed. I must sleep now. I am very tired after partying. The alcohol, then it's really sure it has a bit of a small effect on me, but whatever. Hello, bird. How are you do? I feel a little bit sleepy. Oh man, sure shouldn't have smoked all that weed. <laughs> oh look at that, she didn't close her eyes while she slept. Oh dear, I bet she didn't sleep at all. What a shame. So, if I so. put the pieces together, this all started years back, with the arrival of a new life. Dante Manor was a place filled with darkness, and there were outward ambitions and hidden histories in that house. I tried to help. I should not have become so involved. Really now? But how these things unfold when we are thrust on the scene, I can't account for at all. For my part in these events, I waive responsibility. Antonio. But it's there. It's a mark. A mark I should have noticed. <laughs> At its source. At the center of it all. Was the boy. Yes, indeed. Yes, it is I. Lucius. Beware of crosses, they make you weaker. Huh. Outside is burning. 
How strange. Good. Oh. Lucius, there you are. And here I am, finally, face to face. It's okay. You can trust me. You know who I am, don't you? Uh, Satan? I've come to speak to you about your calling, my boy. Each offering you bring me will make you big and mighty. Ooh. It's a simple thing to do, Lucius. You can influence your future and become a master over all. Ooh. Tell me more. But Tell oh, me more. so much to do. So much ahead of you. I have some things for the birthday boy. There, on the desk. Ah, I got us also a batter, a flashlight, and some batteries. Little music box, a notebook, some drawings, what else we got? Sure, and it's not everything, so I miss a bit of everything, right? Maybe it isn't. Ah, here we go. Night notebook. You'll need this notebook. It will help you on your journey. Mm-hmm, indeed. Excellent. And I think the padlock be useful. Man, it's going to dance if we get my padlock done, so... Nobody suspects me. Oh, dear. And look, a flashlight. This will help you find your way around at night. Indeed. Go ahead. Pick up your new toys and see how they work. Oh, definitely. Such a bright boy. From very side of your we're pressing my... Battery. Oh. There we go. Now, Lucius, you need to do a little something. It is important that you are not caught. Mm-hmm. In the kitchen, you left the lock on the freezer door. You will need to get that padlock, Lucius, and hide it where nobody can find it. Otherwise, they will discover you. Oh, dear. I'll have some evidence. And believe me, you wouldn't want that to happen. Oh, no, no, no. Why Go would we now, now? Get the padlock before the adults wake up. Yes, indeed. Oh, for fuck's sake, you lock the damn door. You can use memory if someone has caught you and they all forget everything. Ah. <laughs> uh. Yagahol sure is. Making me feel a little bit dirty, but nonetheless, I still got plenty to do. It's quite amazing too, you know, since uh, the game is, you know, it's it's quite big, you know, and loading screen takes quite a bit of while to load and whatnot. track be real what perfect and of course we remember this place now do we no sodas for grabbing for the Okay, what do I do with this one? Okay. 
Leave it on the side, you know? Leave it on the side. I took a paddle, I should put it in my pocket so not find it. It might be useful later on. <laughs> so they found out where I'm at where I was or what? Well they just found out the dead body. <laughs> Detective McGuffin, what do we got here? It looks like a cardiac arrest, sir. The woman collapsed in the walk-in freezer. This was probably caused by the sudden change of temperature. She was in her mid-fifties. Typical of women her age. Did you talk with the owner of the house? No, sir. They're waiting for you in the kitchen. How can something like this happen, Detective? <laughs> Was it a seizure of some kind? Hey, Hart? We'll look into it, but it looks like a case of misadventure. I'd ask that you stay clear of the kitchen and keep staff away while... While what? Sorry about that. Yeah, the, 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 the uh, wind is just minimized for no reason. We clean up. Just relax and focus on getting life back to normal. Thanks, Detective. We'll try our best. Of course, he'll try our best, right? Of course, he'll all he'll do. July 12, 1972. Smoking kills. This'll be something now. Oh, for the love of Christ. There. I have been having this problem for quite a bit of while, for a long time. No, no re, no solution at all whatsoever. And uh, what's this guy? A freaking alcoholic? His neck is a little dented to the side. Hi, Gene. Thank goodness you're here. Things are a mess. This could have real negative repercussions in an election year. <clears throat> huh. It's a private matter. And an unfortunate accident. The press will keep out of it. I've seen to that. They better do. I could always count on you, Gene. Make yourself at home while I tidy up some papers. Just ring for Alistair if you need anything. But Take all the time you need. But of course, I say, but of course. A little ball. I've got some toys here. What's this here? Another toy car. I figured I might as well just put everything inside. Sure update, 110%. Ah. Uh, Gene. Father colleague. He visits my father sometime for business. I hate when he smokes in the rooms and it gives me a headache. So he must, uh, get a little something as well, too. I tell you that. Uh, what else am I missing? Get back inside already, Jesus Christ! Completed current behavior status 50%. At least still, uh, how might I say, get the good impression that I'm a very clean boy. At least for now. The Democrats must not suspect a thing while I, while they die, I'd say. Get in sight already, Jesus Christ. 
my room. Okay, that's all taken care of. Good. What the hell is this? Oh, some... <clears throat> Alright. Interesting to know. We'll take that along. Well... They should have something of interest over here as well, too, haven't they? Mind me while I loot your belongings. Of course, it's locked over there. Good to know. I don't care. <sighs> All right then. Nope. No, nothing there at all, too. Who would have thought? Hey, book. Why are these here? Do any of you not know how to put some dirt in some laundry in place? Good Christ. They're so unorganized. Don't worry, Lucius. Mary is now in a much better place, along with her husband. Good. She might well better be. And also, do put your underwear in in the laundry, please. Ah, dirty. I mean, uh, it's locked. Whatever. She'll probably get a better feel for the house, you know, just in case. Even though that I'm partially drunk, then I don't know how well that's gonna go. Some shit in the floor. Socks is all too. There, leave it there. Yeah, I know. Why did these assholes hadn't have such Weird places. I mean, it seems to be so inconvenient as well, as well, too, and. I don't think so, pal. Nope. It's a waterfall, say. Good. I don't know. Hey, I don't I'm know. working here. This is not for children. Good to know. All right then. I mean, sure I could take your laundry note to some place if I ever kn only knew where to go. But regardless, well, too. I mean, why do I always gotta move on? Are all these hallways necessary? Because I don't feel it. Because I don't feel like it all. They all are. I don't need that. Well, not at least now. Whatever. Someone got killed at point blank range, good to know. It's a radio. A closet. <laughs> a bottle of alcohol at my hands, good. I can I might be able to cut some fire with it a little too. But in the meanwhile, well, I might as well just, uh... Hey! I'm working here! This is not for children! Sure, sure. I can't jump, too. So, yeah, do that. And the creeps can actually spy on me on the, on the, uh... From over there as well, too. You see, I'm performing a delicate operation here. Why don't you go downstairs and watch TV or something? Hmm. 
Even kijken, de, de, de poor fellow over here didn't even realize that I just uh, snagged out some of his, uh, uh, how shall I say, I haven't snagged out some of his uh, tools. Dining room, alright. Did you remember to brush your teeth? Don't make me remind you again. Oh, of course, of course. Be careful, Lucius. That was expensive. Right, right. Brush teeth. All right. It's funny how little regard I show for these bottles of alcoholic beverages. Hmm, this is the metal one. It wouldn't let you break out so goddamn easy now, wouldn't it? Ah, I might be a Catholic, but... Well... There's our friend over there. Goddamn, the alcohol really kicked in a little, too. <sighs> well, there you are, Lucius. Let me look at you. I believe you've grown since I last saw you. Indeed, I have, indeed. Oops! Well, accidents do happen. I'm sure it's alright. <laughs> I love how laid back this guy is. How are your lessons going? They're going pretty darn well, my friend. Thank you for asking. There's nothing to do without a tool. Pebbles have half an inch bolts. Alright. Christ almighty. Irrelevant. At least for now, and now can be some really dizziness kicking in for some reason. Of course, I need to brush my teeth as well too, so yeah. Whatever. Get much appreciated as well too. These things are going to work out the first second and who the fuck is pulling all these things? Alright, right. right. Where the Jesus Christ my goddamn toothbrush. Behavior status 75% good. Now this is good, at least so these guys wouldn't uh, suspect a single thing. Clean the room, brush teeth. Perfect. I don't see where hey, she got the dirty I'm working laundry. here. This is not for children. Of course. Try not to bother your father today, dear. Jean is here and they have business to take care of. Sure, sure. Some of these objects, I know I just picked them up and just flung them, just flinged them around, you know, all pointlessly at best. It's not even marked out of the crime scene. What gives? So our friend over here, how the hell are we gonna go about doing this, I'd say? Right, right, right. Light bulb. Check Dennis. An empty water bottle too. Alright, good, good. Wait, well, not at least now. Go ahead. I 
wasn't even watching. I know he can be a bit odd, but be a sweetheart and be polite to Jean. He is a guest in our house after all. Indeed, indeed. How could I ever be so... Mistaken? Stop creeping around, Lucius. You're making me nervous. Whoops. Well, accidents do happen. I'm sure it's all right. Right, I know this guy's a bit of a politician as well, too. <sighs> well, there you are, Lucius. Let me look at you. I believe you've grown since I last saw you. Yes, yes, indeed. How are your lessons going? They're going pretty darn well, I'd say. Have you seen my matches? No, I have not. Who would have thought about that? Like cigarettes and yeah, but you probably set us up some kind. Stop creeping around, Lucius. You're making me nervous. After making I have to race him all the way to the kitchen now. Are oh, you son of a bitch? Yeah, I love how just he gives with it, but at least now I know what to do. And yes, you know, I feel like for all the more drunk as well, too. Well, dizzy at best, too. I don't want to see about this guy here. Leave me alone! Creep! I hate you so much. Okay, good, 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 good. Okay, good, good. At least a friend over here should be around here somewhere. Got enough smoke of his life, yeah? Uh, I think it was, that was something special too, you know. <sighs> I feel dizzy. Lucius, I told you. This stuff is not for children. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've been cursed with the dark spirits, not my fault. Can't you see I'm performing a delicate operation here? Why don't you go downstairs and watch TV or something? That's the idea, friend. That is the idea, alright. Besides, I mean, see all this, since they're all distracted and all that stuff, I figure I might as well just uh, snaggle up a few things for myself. Okay, good, good, good. A bit of an interesting glitch. Don't worry, there. Lucius. Mary is now oh. in a much better place, <laughs> along with her husband. Sure, sure. I can see that in her too. Might be a bit stereotypical as well, too, but hey. Hello, boy. Asshole. Achievement lock, there is no answer. Okay, good. Cause now my eyes they feel like I better be in a bit of cross it will too at best. Right, then. This will make some use out of it at best too. <laughs> <laughs> Let's take this away for now at least. Yeah, yeah, I know. I gotta kill the guy here too. 
is here smoking and drinking all day long. <sighs> well, there you are, Lucius. Let me look at you. I believe you've grown since I last saw you. Mm-hmm. Go ahead. I wasn't even watching it. Indeed, I mean. See, you know the babble that these guys are always doing and whatnot? Oops. Well, accidents do happen. I'm sure it's all right. Sure, sure, indeed. So you How are your seen. lessons going? Yeah, they did pretty darn well, I'd say. Have you seen my matches? I have not. Perhaps she used the stove, I mean. I heard the stove is like one big lighter you can use to light up your cigarettes. Clearly nothing bad could happen, right? I mean... Have you seen my matches? I have not. And clearly as well too, I mean, there's a source of fire right over there. So, yeah. This will be something. Mm. Light. Where can I get light? There's a ah, fireplace, but whatever. I'll be sleeping quite heavy tonight, I'll give I I'll get that. Have some fun with that, friendo. <laughs> That is what you get for being a fucking smoker, pal. Power's growing. Good. The more we'll get to fuck around with these folks. Hey, hey. Uh, what can I say, Mr. Wagner? This is a real unfortunate series of events. Quite uncanny. Indeed, quite uncanny. Jean was my campaign manager and a friend of the family for many years. I'll be lost without her. I know this must be a difficult time for you, but we really must do an investigation here. I'll need to speak to your handyman about the gas leak. This shouldn't have happened. I had a sure, feeling there was sure. something weird going on in that house. I couldn't quite yet put the pieces together, so... I took a step back for a while, let it brew. And after a few weeks, the call came in. Just when things were getting back to normal, there had been another accident in that godforsaken house. It happened on a rainy day. I think it was Tuesday. The janitor, who was known to be quite the drinker, was fixing a bathroom in the Lower West Wing. Mm-hmm. In the Lower West Wing. Oh dear, what could happen, right? Clearly nothing bad could happen at all, right? Why would it even? Tell me about it. Why, oh, hello there. Hello, Lucius. Here we are again. Indeed. You've been doing very well, haven't you? My, you make me proud. <laughs> but I must teach you some of the more, let us say, subtle arts which you can use. Tell you me can more. train your mind to move objects at your will. Here, let me show you how. Excellent. Okay. Very good. Okay, okay. Okay, you got this, I got this. No, not yet. Oh, there we go. Excellent. Okay. Try to move the box. Very good. 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 
good indeed. Now you know what to do, my son. You must continue with your mission and bring these souls. Be careful, but show no mercy. Sure, sure. It'll clearly be out so damn well. Oh, trust me, why... Why would it be even all that bad, yeah? Tone death. Huh. Oh, dear. Clue is only wrong what have happened. Well... Don't worry. Since this is a... Starting point at best, I believe we both could, uh, work some mutual benefits, right? <laughs> Alright. Two person by two person, old pal. The janitor it is this time, apparently. It feels a little, little tad strange, a little too like this would happen. Also, my mouth is a little bit old as well, too, so... I hope you don't mind. Hey, hey. There you are. Did you see the well? Indeed I have. It's quite a bit of a nasty rain outside, isn't it? I must speak to your father about that handyman. Tell us about that handyman. Do tell us. And also things are going a little bit weird, isn't it? Lady, what are you doing? There's some really weird music playing on. I can't interact with this. Right, right, right. You know what? Maybe this is why. Because I'm interacting with the things at hand. And therefore... Locked. Oh dear. I might as well just turn off these lights, otherwise they'll overheat and explode, right? There you are, friend. I've been wondering about you. Ah, the old chap. He's drunk, so I probably would notice if I change the plans up a bit. Good. Hello, you are drunk. How are you? You see all these? You see that depressible too? And sure, I mean, he's drunk. He's drinking all too. Drunk. Ah, uh, one fortunate, I'd say. Fix the piano. Good, good indeed. And thus, I mean, wouldn't mind if I just, uh, would whip out this thing over here? Well, on. Somehow. There you are, you big tough boy. 
Look at yourself, you got this. See? Always loose. Oh, do tell about that, my friend, do tell. But look at you, you can get the fix, why right, aren't you? You're a tough guy, you can get it done. Off you go. Oh dear. It's gonna go through down the well here. I hate to tell you this, Mr. Wagner, but it seems your handyman is drunk as a skunk. He was an accident waiting to happen. Really? I was going to fire him after the other incidents, but I just didn't have the heart. It's hard enough to keep the staff here with recent events. Oh, you can't you blame can. yourself. This might be the worst case of professional neglect I've ever come across. While this might explain the gas leak, it still doesn't explain the death in the walk-in cooler. The autopsy on the mate is inconclusive, but we're still working on the theory she had a poor heart or circulation problems and fainted. Indeed. Indeed. She sure did have. September 11, 1972, for the edge. You the best part of being drunk as well, too. Like, uh, seeing these texts move around in such a fashion as well, too, that, uh, I feel a little off track as well too. Oh look at this. I seem to have took a bit of a nap as well too. Well oh, yeah, I'll get to wait for a bit. Hope you got to enjoy it as much as I did. Look for the next one. So I'll see you guys next time and uh until then. <laughs>